This is your News 4 update, powered by the Bomarito Automotive Group. Hey, good morning, everyone. I'm Maurice Drummond. Here are some stories making headlines on this Monday. Developing this morning, St. Louis City Police are working to solve the killing of a 19-year-old woman. She was found shot to death early Sunday morning in the Baden neighborhood. Three other victims were also shot in that same incident. Today, St. Louis County's mass mandate will be challenged in court again. A hearing is scheduled today of the first mandate implemented by County Executive Dr. Sam Page. That mandate is now void as St. Louis County passed a second mask order with support of the County Council. But Attorney General Eric Schmidt says he'll fight the latest order through his existing court case. And today we'll hear from former Cards Manager Mike Schilt. For the first time since he was fired by the organization last week, Cards President of Baseball Operations John Mazalock says the decision was due to philosophical differences despite Schilt leading the Redbirds to the playoffs for three straight years. We're going to bring you all the updates from today's press conference on your Camel V News app. Time now for a check of the weather. Man, it's been absolutely spectacular. I'm Ken. telling you, you don't get better weather than this. Yesterday, 73 degrees, beautiful sunny skies. Beauty again today, just a little bit warmer at 76, thanks to a southwest wind at 5 to 10 miles per hour. But nice dry air, a beautiful crisp morning. Watch the super predictor now as we started at 10 o'clock tonight and we see these clouds roll into the area by 6 a.m. tomorrow. Fear not, no rain expected with these clouds in the back end should be moving through the metro area by lunch hour so that we get into some afternoon sun again tomorrow that will help to warm us up to about where we are today. So again, 76 degrees today for the high temperature, 75 tomorrow with some morning clouds, a 40% chance of rain and storms on Wednesday, and then breezy and cooler on Thursday with a high of 65 down to 62 on Friday. And then on uh, Saturday, it looks really nice. A morning low of 44 and a high of 62. Another little chance for some rain by Sunday.